What is going on, everybody? We're coming in, taking another look at the Super Saiyan 3 Bardock, and this time we have the Tech Bardock on the team. He was the one I left off of the Omega Shinron fight. Um, again, I haven't messed with these guys' builds very much, but I figured I'd at least show this guy. So we've got, what is it, 4 dodge on this guy just from the equip, uh, 17 crit, and I think this is 9 additional, so... Uh, these were some of the first characters I ever pulled on my account, like if I was to sort by like date acquired or whatever it is, uh, you would see that they were, you know, like some of the first characters I got, so. But we're gonna go ahead and hop in here to the Broly fight, where dodging is worthless, we have some intros to play here in the first, so we are going to go ahead and mute and play those. <laughs> Um, so we've got the Trunks and Vegeta, and we got Bardock here. If you notice, we are on the Trunks and Vegeta team this time. It's because I'm done playing around with Bardock's team. I, I don't like it. I don't, I don't want to run them. So we are on, like, a, a lesser leader skill here, but I'm over it. I'm done with it. I can't be asked to run that team anymore, so, um, unless I just absolutely have to. Uh, we are going to start by doing this, though, which kind of sucks. Uh, I'm going to leave this Vegeta and Trunks on rotate. Well, who has... Hmm. Yeah, there's is slightly better because theirs is actually rainbowed. Uh, mine will be soon. You know, give me like uh, eight days or something. Okay, we can't even stack with them. That's good. Um, well, we can just get the blue orbs. We can get the physical with this guy, and we're just gonna move on with our lives. Yeah, I I didn't want to put bar. Ugh, ugh, man. I don't know. Uh, maybe I misplayed that. Maybe I should just kept both Vegeta and Trunks on rotation. I don't know. Oh, maybe I misplayed there. Oh, excuse me. So, yeah, Bardock. Uh, I haven't decided where I like him in my rankings. I, 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 like, I feel very confident about saying Kid Goku, Gamma 1, Ginyu, Gamma 2, maybe Yamcha. I, I feel pretty good about that. Yeah, once we get past that, though, is whenever I'm like, uh, Bardock, uh, I don't, uh, like, uh, uh, like, I start, like, I start really stressed, like, I don't want to say I stress about it, but it's like, man, where do I put Bardock? Like, I, I like what he's doing, I like what he's bringing to the team, but I don't really like running his team at the moment, like, it, it's Goku family, so you think that I would like running the Goku's family team, but I, I don't, I don't like running it, I don't think he's a good leader for it. Um, I, I think he has a lot of value in what he's bringing to the team for the first five turns, but after that, it's like, uh... And some of these fights, like, he's pretty good for the red, for the Wicked Bloodline red zone, but for some of these red zones, it's like, I don't really, uh, I don't get it. Alright, so... I'm actually gonna try to keep as many of these tech orbs around for the tech Bardock as I can. Uh, good, because he gets like... Oh, what is it? One, it's gonna heal us, but two... Um, the, the important parts down here is he gets an additional super attack or a medium chance of launching an additional super attack with three, uh, key spheres. And then he gets a 50% attack buff and a crit with eight key spheres. So if we can get that here, which we can, uh, or well, let me rephrase. If we can get to him on the rotation, he's going to do pretty decent damage, I think. But I, I don't think we're going to get past the, uh, Super Saiyan 3 Bardock. This is a good rotation. So even though uh, Super Saiyan 3 Bardock's on like uh, only 170% leader skill here, he is still next to God Goku, which is going to help him out. So uh, it, it's going to activate that other part of his passive. All right. Don't. Oh, yeah. he's It's a guaranteed additional super attack. So yeah, we get the guaranteed double super every time we're next to God Goku here. So that's good. Um, this will make a good rotation. You know, I'll have to float off Vegeta and Trunks a little bit, and that'll be a little wonky. But oh, we got another intro. Hmm, 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 hmm
Nice. This is actually kind of ideal for the gods, actually. Oh, this is a really good rotation, too. Um, what do I want to do here, though? I think I want to do this. And then we can build up Vegeta and Trunks a little bit. And then we can stack with the gods. And then just float off Bardock so that we don't have to... Hopefully, we don't have to he deal with him on the AoE phase. For some reason, I forgot to bring Ghost Ushers. I don't really know what I was thinking there. Because uh, for this fight, you really do just want to bring Ghost Ushers if you're doing, like, showcase videos. If you're not trying to go for no item runs or challenge runs or something like that like for me i'm just trying to showcase how these characters do and it's like i don't really care how they perform in like that cheap aoe phase where you just can't survive you know it's like there's very few units that can and i don't think bardock is one of them uh really any of them the tech bardock or the int super saiyan 3 bardock i don't think the tech bardock the uh, super saiyan one can survive you know i think pretty much everyone else has the ability to survive depending on when they super but the, the Bardock characters just have no survivability against that AoE phase, so I probably should have brought a Ghost Usher, but it, it is what it is, okay? Um, if we live, we live. If we die, we die. We saw, we see what we need to see, so. Holy cow, we're just gonna take him out, like, right here? If the gods triple super, I mean, there's a chance that we just one phase this Broly. I don't know, I don't think that would be good, though. Because, you know, they can crit, yeah. If they had triple supered there, and then Bardock double supers, uh, we might have been out of this phase. Because Bardock's going to guarantee crit? Yeah. Yeah, if they had triple supered, then we would have been out of here. Alright. Which, maybe that's what we would have wanted, because I think this is actually what we want going into that phase. Um... So, I listen, I know... Oh, man. Alright, well, we're going to do this. Yeah, uh, this is all we can do, really. We'll have to watch my Vegeta and Trunks. It's going to be a little spooky. They're going to come back around against Broly. Uh, well, the AGL Broly, probably. And uh, they're not going to be built up at all. I don't think they've taken... They haven't taken a single hit, have they? Mm, maybe one or two. So that's going to be really spooky. What do we got? Oh, can we break that? Awesome. I think we can. Okay, we're gonna do this. Uh, let's watch this animation. Alright, here we go. So this is where I was talking about in my top 10 Dokkan Fest, or like top 10 LRs in Dokkan right now. This is where I was talking about the attack break ability. So right here, uh, guess what? We just, uh, Broly can't super us on this turn. That's just, it is what it is, right? So, uh, we, we have nothing to worry about at all on this rotation. Maybe that Tech Bardock at the end will take a little bit of damage because we weren't able to super with him. And they're going to take a little bit of damage because they weren't able to super, or they didn't get very many stacks before we transform with them. But this uh, right here is going to protect us and give us a chance to live because we break the action right there. And Broly's super attack was first. They fixed the glitch where you could break like an invisible action, so, or a non-action. So, uh, that's this. I mean, this is really good, right? So there goes the super attack, and boom, now we're just safe on this rotation. I, that There's no way that Bardock takes 250k per hit at the end there. Like, I refuse to believe that that's how much damage he takes. But I didn't actually look at his defense. This probably doesn't hit very hard on his normals, though, from what I remember. But I guess he did 100k to the gods, so I, maybe he does, like, 100k to this Broly as well. Maybe a little bit more. I think, worst case scenario, he does, like, 200k per hit, and we have to use an item next turn. I don't think he does more than 250k, though. There's no way, right? Yeah, 184. Okay, that's fine. Um, depending on where the super... This is our last turn with the scouter, right? Do we have it? Uh, ooh, or is this not the last... Is the scouter gone? Um, hmm. Um, do we want to use this now? I guess we might as well just get the damage in. I guess let's do it. Uh, let's just play this. I know we're just playing active skills right now. We got to get through this phase. Oh, 
で全てが変わる己の運命そして貴様の運命はCool, cool, cool. So, another thing that does is that does count as a build up in our passive towards getting his like super attack built up. So, I'm not sure where we were、uh, in terms of getting that built up, but that, that, that puts us a little bit closer now. So, who has the better? Let's see, he actually does. So, let's try to get minimal orbs with God Goku and then just get like one orb with the Super Saiyan 3 Bardock. Very self sufficient with key, by the way. And then we can heal up a decent amount here with this guy. Probably should have used an item, but、uh, if we get supered, we're dead here regardless, so it doesn't really matter if we use an item or not. Basically, we either KO Broly on this turn or we get KO'd by Broly if he supers.、Um, if he doesn't super, then we will probably live. Alright, 6.5 from Bardock, no support on the rotation.、Uh, guaranteed additional coming in because we have Goku on rotation. I'm pretty sure I have this guy built full crit, by the way, so. I mean, I don't have any equips on him, but, you know, he could be critting right now. This is another reason why I give my units full dodge, is because they just don't crit and they don't additional. So, why even bother giving them those when they're not going to do it? Come on, please, please. Oh my goodness. Are we. I think we're dead. Probably because I didn't heal. I should have used the item. Well, uh. Yeah. Oh, well, we were dead regardless. Yeah, see, that, that's what I mean. This Bardock just can't take supers in these events, so. I mean, honestly, I'm pretty content with that.、Uh, I don't really need to go against AGL Broly. I mean, this guy died against.、Um, he died against STR Broly, so.、And、pretty substantially, too. Even if we were at full health there, I mean, I just saved a Sinzu Bean, honestly, on this turn.、Um, but Bardock did kind of sell us there. The,、uh, the Tech Bardock, it, or, or the Int Bardock. Let me look at his build real quick. You know, we're sitting here talking about it. Let me just look him up. Let's type in a three here. We scroll down to it. What does he build? Yeah, I have full crit on him. Like, this is the max crit that you can give him from his hidden potential system because I never updated it. Like, I haven't used this character since I rainbowed him, basically. I don't even remember when that was. It wasn't his initial banner. I don't remember what banner it was, but、uh, I slapped this orb on him probably because there was a mission to, like,、uh, put a skill orb on a character, and I just put this on him. Just because I was like, ah, whatever, here's a level 5 attack. Just put that on the character. And,、uh, or maybe it was for like Super Battle Road or something. I don't know. Because I, I might have been doing some Super Saiyan 3 no item attempts. And yeah, but yeah, I think、uh, full dodge is actually what you want to do on this guy. Because、uh, if you noticed,、uh, did we get a single crit in that entire video with this guy? Like, he, he double supered every single turn. He had a 30% chance to crit on all of those. I would have much rather him had like a 20% chance to dodge. Um, but you know,、uh, to each their own. You know, crit will definitely get you more value out of this guy. And you're, somebody's gonna be like, oh, just put skill orbs on him, then he'll crit. It's like, well,、uh, I already have, I'm ye of little faith, you know. Now, dodge wouldn't have helped us against Broly there, but against other fights, like, I'm not taking this guy against the core. Like, I'm sorry. I, I know I normally do a core showcase with, like, these characters. No way I'm taking this guy against the core. Uh, he's just, he, I'm not doing it. That, that's just a complete waste of my time. It's a complete waste of your time.、Um, so, anyway, let me know what you guys think about that.、Um, how, how this guy performed, or not this guy, how this guy performed in there.、Um, uh, is Broly still the hardest boss? I,、hmm, I think Broly's the cheapest boss. I don't think Broly's the hardest boss. I think, I don't even know if I want to say the core is the hardest boss. I think the core is like. How do I? I don't know where I rank the core. I don't think Cell Mac. I don't know what the hardest fight in the game is. Honestly, I don't, I don't know. I'll have to think about that. Anyway, let me know what you guys think. Thank you for watching. I appreciate it. I'll catch you guys in the next video.